Hey and welcome back to the Jazzy Nation. So in today's video, we are doing a morning routine and we're starting off by just waking up, waking the body up, getting ourselves together, realizing that it is morning. And I do that probably by yawning. Did you just yawn yourself? I then grab my notebook because I really like to be intentional with my time and I like to start off with my morning pages and I write at least three pages in my notebook on a more productive day like this and um, yeah I really like taking the time in the morning to just chill with my thoughts and to dump everything that I have on paper usually I wake up before my husband or I'll write my morning pages outside of the room but today he woke up before me and is just telling me goodbye so after morning pages, I try to get up as fast as I can because if I don't, then I'm on my phone and I try to get dressed for the gym and then I make my bed. Making your bed right away sets the intention right for the day and if your bed is made, you won't get back in if it's made. So you gotta get to the hygiene part, always, always with the hygiene and I probably sit and contemplate my life for like two whole minutes and then I get my hair put into a low ponytail because it's super easy and no fuss. Shoes on and then we grab all of our things, headphones included, and head to the gym. This is my new favorite machine and I don't know what it's called but I love it so much. It helps with the butt and abs and just your lower body really well and of course i'm listening to a podcast this is the how i built this podcast with guy raz and it helps to set my intention so that i'm not too distracted while i'm working out sometimes i watch youtube videos but for a productive day this is what i do is where you will not do a single push-up in fact you're gonna be in this position to be honest with you guys, I was not into working out, so I decided to do a Blogilates strength workout at home because I knew that I needed to finish off the strength, but I didn't want to stay at the gym. To help continue to clear my mind, because I have to be honest with you again, I was kind of not having the best morning, I have to clean up. And cleaning up my home helps me to clear my mind, especially when I feel like things are out of my control. I do things that are in my control and that make me feel a little bit more centered and a little bit more grounded. The next thing that helps me feel great is to eat a good breakfast and drink lots of water. So here is my cheater's breakfast for when you are just needing to eat something but don't really want to cook. I'm cracking two eggs in a mug, then I'm whipping that together. I add my seasonings, my salt and my pepper, a little bit of oil so that it doesn't stick. And I get my tortillas out because we're making egg tacos, pop that bad boy in the microwave, and there you go. I added a little bit of spinach there too. So again, setting myself right for the day. I can't do anything unless it's clean, so I just did the dishes. And then I was free to eat, and it looks so good, and it was so good. I have to pray before I eat as well because... It helps me to remain grateful, especially when I find that things are not going my way. I just pray so that I can remind myself to just slow down. And I decided to do a little bit of work, but to be honest with you, my mental space wasn't very clear and I just wanted to eat. So I stopped with the work, ate my tacos, enjoyed myself, just kind of quieted my mind and finished my food over by the counter just to get away from my camera get away from everything get away from my phone all of that stuff but now we're back on our phone i'm talking to my mom and i just love this time in the morning when i get to talk to my mom because she definitely brightens my day gives me good advice makes me laugh and just motivates me to continue with things because it can be hard, it really can be, but also getting dressed helps. 
you to just set good intentions for your day. So making yourself look presentable, even if you're not going anywhere. Today was a filming day, so I had to kind of look a little bit better than I did earlier in the day, but this actually was perfect. It was an easy look, minimal makeup, minimal hairstyle, and I loved it, and it was no fuss. So yeah, let me know what your morning routine looks like when you are trying to be productive but you need a little bit of extra boost what helps you get that extra boost guys let me know in the comment section below i'll see you all in the next video thank you so much for watching and i'll talk to you next time bye guys